Hey everybody, welcome to Ms. Hoffman's group. We are going to practice our nonsense words. Fingers up, ready, read. Prack. We know it's prack because whenever I see a CK, that comes after the short vowel. So we only say the short vowel sound in prack. Now, if the last k sound was a K, then we would need a magic E and it would say prank. Threp. It's closed because there's a consonant. Threp. But if I add a magic E, it's threep. Plib. And if I add magic E, it's plibe. Grox. If I add magic E, now it's Grox. That wouldn't work because X has to come at the end of the word, so we can't add a magic E. It's just Grox. Dwund. I know it's the short U because I have two consonants, so it's Dwund. Wink. Whenever I have I and K, that comes at the end of a syllable. Wink. Shung, slung, stang, bring. Now I could add the suffix s and have brings, or I can have ing and get bringing. Squank, and if I add a suffix, I get squanking. Or if I add the S, I get squanks. Snonk. With the suffix, it becomes snonks or snonking. Now we have, can't have two QUs in a row, but we could do quonk or quonking. Or now the word is quonks. Shrunk. Remember when I have I have the letter Y at the end of a, of a syllable, I have stry. All right, let's try some with magic E again and some blends. Now we have strund, struth, struff. I can't use the short U set, the long U sound. It has to be short because I have the two consonants and it makes it stay shut. I can't even use a magic E here. Magic E can't jump over two consonants. All right, now we have scrot, but if I add magic E, it becomes scrot. This is draught, but magic E becomes drought. Sk it. This doesn't follow our rule. I can't have the letter I come after the letter C and have it make the K sound. So we're going to skip this one and go to glit. And if I add the magic E to it, I would have, where is Magic E? Magic E disappeared on us. And now my word is glight. Let's try another one. Splut, because the consonant makes the vowel short E. But if I add a silent sneaky E, I get spleet. Now I have smate, because magic E jumps over the consonant and gives the power to the long vowel sound, and it's a smate. Trat, trait. 
spit, spit, look at my mouth, spit, makes a wide smile, spit, but this is spit, see how my mouth goes tall, spit, 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 And now we have yet. I know this says ya because when Y comes at the beginning of the word, it's always going to say ya as in yarn. So yet, and with magic E is yet. All right, now because there's a letter K here, I can't have the, I have to have an E, I, or Y after it. So we have sket, skeet. Chat, short vowel sound first, chat, with magic E, we jump over the consonant and we get chate. And now we have sw it becomes swiped with the magic T. Or I can do switing. All right. Now let's do blot, bloat, flot, float, sprut, sprout. Magic E jumps over the consonant and it's sprout. And we're going to stop there today with our nonsense works. Thanks guys for joining me today and I remind reminding you to watch this video three times and send in the chat box to your teacher three nonsense words that we practiced today. See you soon.